I'm going to show you how to make this pop-up rig, so stick around for the rest of the video and I'm going to bring you through step by step. Take about 8mm shrink tube and pop it over the eye of the hook. Now grab your hook clip, pop that through the eye and pull the shrink tube over your hook clip. Now grab yourself a lighter and you want to shrink that tube in down so it's nice and secure. Now this is down to personal preference but I like to use bait screws or you can use a micro ring swivel. Get your hook bead, pop that over the hook and slide it round so that it's opposite the barb. And that's our hook section done. Cut yourself off about 10 inches of hybrid stiff. Then you want to pop through a crimp, double it over, back through, grab your crimping tool in the small section and snug that down. Slide on your anti-tangle sleeve and pull that down to your crimp. Pop your tag end through another crimp. Pass your tag through the ring of the hook swivel. Then pass your tag through the second barrel of that crimp and then you can start to snug it down like we did before in the small section of the tool. Snip off any excess tag next to the crimp. Grab your knot pullers and just test that rig's nice and secure. And now we can move on to making sure that that rig is nice and straight. So whack on that kettle and a couple of passes is all you need. To make sure this rig sticks nice and firmly to the deck of the late bed, we're gonna use a little bit of tungsten putty just rolled around that crimp. Now grab the tiniest amount extra of putty and just roll that round the center of that rig. Now we can attach our bait of choice. I'm gonna be using a little yellow pop-up on this one. And that's it, you're done. It really is that easy. If you want to get any of the bits that you need to make this rig, check out the showcase link under the bio on my homepage. And all that's left to do now is a little bit of a water test. Excuse the bugs in the bucket, but as you can see, pin to the bottom, and that's a bite all day long.